the very best way to make custom when i say custom i mean badass custom wallpaper for your phone for your tablet for your desktop computer basically any device you can make custom wallpaper it's a phenomenal tool for create even if you're not a creator right it's a fabulous uh website they also have a um application for windows and i believe mac os if you're a macbook user awesome 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 i use it every single day now now there is a free version but i suggest using the pro version now i'm just gonna go show you how to make the uh the best custom wallpaper for your device now so here's your, here's what you're gonna do you can do a generalized 1080 by 1920 uh, wallpaper but what I like to do to get real specific and then just google whatever your device is right so I'm gonna do nothing phone 2 so google the name of your phone the model of your phone so I have nothing phone 2 you're gonna get your screen resolution again you don't have to do this but I do it just to get a perfect cut of what your screen is gonna look like when you make this wallpaper we go find your phone and then go to display and where is it? Right here, resolution. Display resolution, 1080 by 2412. We're going to go to Canva. What you're going to do is go create a design and go to custom size. So what I'm going to do is do that. And then I'm going to select, uh, what is it? 1080 and then 2412. That's one way, right? So it's gonna give me the layout of what my screen looks. Now, here they have templates over here on the side. Then you can search for templates, wallpaper, uh, slide over to phone wallpapers. And here you go, it'll give you templates. Now, all these are uh, are editable. So, ed just say editable. You can edit all of these. So you can, search through different types so even if you and then it'll give you once you select it underneath here on the left it'll give you similar or like uh designs right like that's awesome right here you can also star them or favorite them so you can save them go to your uh, favorite section um that's what i do i usually scroll through uh, scroll through for a little while choose the ones i like so i can always go back to them but if there was a design you like, but you don't like the word space, or if you like this, but you don't like the word last man, like watch, let's replace this. Uh-oh, there we go. It spread it out to my resolution. Here's the key. Once you get this going, watch. Uh, let's do, let's change that. Input eSIM. Let's move it up. Let's make it a little bigger. We'll stretch it out like this. And then we will duplicate it and then modify that one. And if it's too big, all you do is just simply spread it out that way. Spread it out that way. Maybe reduce it a little bit until it goes flat. There we go. So we got ESM Studios, like the channel of our YouTube youtube channel okay so that looks cool right what if you want to change the color of the of the uh of the words simple easy boom no nah, i don't like that let's go and you can always hit the back button that looks pretty cool let's let's do it like this right so once you have it here simply type up here esim studios phone wallpaper enter now there's two ways you can add, you can put this on your phone you can hit the share button you can hit the download button and see it's perfect size for my phone resolution it'll save it as a png file we're going to download it now you can download it on your computer transfer it to your phone or if you have if you have canva um on your once you sign in and get an account what you can do 
is download the app on your phone, sign in, and it's all cloud synced. So as soon as you sign in on your phone, open the Canva app up on your phone, boom, it'll be right there, front and center. And then you can download it on your device. But I'm going to save it right here into my photo pictures app. Well, let me show you what it looks like. Watch. So I'm going to go to Canva on my phone. Now I already have this installed on my phone, but so here's my, there's my wallpaper at the moment. So now I opened up Canva and watch. It'll be front and center. Look, ECM Studios, watch. Boom, right there. So what we're gonna do, simply hit the download button. It downloads a PNG right to your phone, downloading. So then what we'll do is, home settings, whoops, I mean customization, duh. And what we'll do is we'll go to more wallpapers, however you set it up on your device. It's right there in my Canva file. Open that up, hit that. Go to use as, and again, this will vary depending on what device you have, but for Android, it's basically the same. Yes, wallpaper. I don't need to crop it. Boom. Looks badass. High definition. Now, I have, a, I have a collection of my very best AMOLED wallpapers. I'll put a link in the description of this video um, that it's got over 100 really, really cool wallpapers that look badass on AMOLED devices. Now, I have that link in my channel description, but I'm going to link it in the bottom uh, or in this description box as well. So you can see my collection of wallpapers for my phones. Now let's do desktop. This looks cool. But I'm going to edit this and put eSIM. But I'm going to do it in our eSIM studios. But I'm going to do it in our classic bright yellow and or neon. Whoa, wait, hold up. What was that? Yo, I need that. I'm going to do that one too. That was freaking cool. All right, let's do this and modify the color. Bright yellow. Okay, so we're going to save that. Boom. Okay, so after you download it, you go and locate the file, right click it, and then you select this, set as desktop background. Boom. See, I need to move it over a little bit, but that's fine. Um, so anyways, that's a quick way to make a customized wall AMOLED wallpaper for your phone, tablet, iPad, PC, Mac, whatever you have. Video's been long enough, but uh basically you know that's the easy look I i'm sure there's other ways to customize wallpapers this is just how i do it it's very fast i know this may i made this video probably longer than it should be like i do with most of my videos but it's the easiest way it's free it's simple anybody can do it you can do it on your phone you don't have to do it on your desktop i'm just doing it on my desktop because um i can record it easy right um, you don't even have to do it on your desktop you can download Canva on your phone, the Canva app, go to your app store. It's on Android and iPhone and design it all on your phone, download it, and then go to your gallery and then uh, select it as your wallpaper. So easy, easy, easy. So uh, thank you for joining us. If you got any questions, let me know in the comments. I check them every day. Enjoy, and I will see you all tomorrow. Peace out.